Tug must have been not even slightly naughty. Do not mock divorced mother guilt. Oh, hand me that bow. What if I met Idris Elba? What? Well, you're hooked up to endless machines, having the time of your brain-dead life with extraordinary measures. And since you are technically alive, well, then I am not single. I am not a widow. Years pass, and, uh, okay, I'm not the kind of woman who... Okay, there are people who think that sex isn't cheating. There are people out there who think that an emotional affair isn't cheating. Well, I'm not either kind of person. It's all cheating. Even though my husband is an idiot who thinks that he will have that one in a zillion chance. Now, no, there are documented cases of people waking up after there years. There are documented of... cases of people who've seen the Loch Ness Monster, too. So what? I will be locked up like some nun, withering and wasting away, lonely and alone, all because you mad at Jesus. So I don't get to have Idris. You taking away my Idris chance. What? <laughs> Idris, help. He could come to Seattle, witness an accident, save a child's life, carry that child in his arms, bad-chested, into my trauma room. You don't know. So you're going to pull the plug on me so you can have your way with Idris Elba? It's Idris Elba.